I'll just sit and sort of like, actually maybe we'll move this out and then I can sort of, we can maybe we can both sit in, in this narrow bathroom. So you are okay and I am still on her bed. Sit in there and then can I can pull in the mat? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Um, and is that the only thing she's getting tonight? Yeah. Not exciting enough. Not exciting enough. Sometimes she gets excited about the kibble, and sometimes she's like, no, only the temptations. But so she's gotten to the point where I can reach in and offer her snacks or like just pet her a little bit, and she doesn't get too freaked out by it, which is good. Um, she's a good girl. A brightening friend. Nice. Aren't you so pretty and special? You are. Um, so if you need to, um, I've I've just been sort of like slowly putting this blanket in because she still likes to have her face covered up. But um, the easiest way to do it is to just sort of move this out and then you can put this down. I'm sure you make lots of notes like I do. And then you can unhook all of, you can unhook this. Okay. And then untie and untie those. And then just the blanket top drops down on her. And then you can just lift this off. Okay. And put it out there. And then she's sort of already wrapped up. Or if you're, if you feel like you can, um, if, if you want to try, which I think she probably will be fine. Because she's kind of gotten used to the mm -hmm. idea. Okay. Yeah. So. I just sort of go in this way with it so it's not coming at her face and just try to get enough in there so that it can cover her up. You can see how good she is about it. It's <laughs> when I whack her in the face with the fringe accidentally and then just cover her little face and then she's totally fine. It's a little bit awkward to get her out. Till she gets there. <laughs> I know, exactly. And Until the babies arrive and then it I know. Then she becomes Tasmanian Skyrex. Do you think medication will be for the rest of her life then? 
um, in order to. No, I. So what was surprising to me was that the um, the ulceration was not like she actually didn't have a lot of active ulceration. So it's scarring. It's tissue. mostly scarring. Okay. So I think. So you will have cleared up any infection. Mm hmm. That's and I'm hoping good diet and low stress and you know, trying to get her as healthy as possible, then hopefully she won't have recurring issues, but, but whoever adopts her will need to be prepared for that the possibility and, and monitor closely for any, like, discharge or redness or if she starts to sort of, like, um, paw at her eyes or anything like that. Hi. Can you have a very good grip? Do you need, need something on your lap? Providing that this is not. No, I'll just. Yeah. There's a couple of cushions right here. Oh. Let me see. Okay, you can grab it. I'm just wrapping her a little bit there. A little less awkwardly. Luckily, she's pretty tolerant of me. Of my awkward ways. Oh, I feel like your face is out. Okay. okay. could um, do like snuggles and stuff first if you wanted to. Probably getting that over with because she probably knows it's inevitable yeah. part of the handling. And I think it doesn't, I, I don't, she doesn't seem to hate it, so it, it may be soothing. Well, you're doing so great with the, your new friend. It's probably already blurry, so. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I certainly don't think it makes anything worse. Oh, she yeah. is good. Very good. So she does try to exit sometimes, but if you cover her face, she just stays. And then she's very, and then she's very good. She may try to get back in there, but then we'll do some snuggles, and some petting. She likes chin rubs. Oh, good girl. Mm -hmm. You are my blind side. I'm going to look at you. <laughs> I know. It's easy to sneak up. He's still a cat, she says. <laughs> Maybe a very good cat, but I'm still a cat. <laughs> yes. He's so cute. He's such a good girl. So then I just hold her and stuff. And try to get her used to... She did um, her first, so she exited my lap at morning meds and then started eating the food and I so I was petting her and she put her tail up for the first time. Oh, so and she ate while you were mm -hmm. in the room. Yeah. And she wasn't in the crate. Yeah. That's awesome. I know. So she's doing really well. I love her little cave. That's I know. Adorable. She's it's very cozy and she's had some very comfortable looking moments. Any movement? Mm hmm oh, oh. There's been a little bit of baby movement. Not like super active. She's definitely gotten bigger. I haven't weighed her, but I keep wanting to, but I just haven't done it yet. I have the scale right out there, so I may weigh her one of these times, just at, out of curiosity. Are you thinking about going somewhere? Mm -hmm. I took down the Lego castle up there because she wasn't jumping all the way up and it wasn't very contrasty, so I don't know if she could really see mm. up there. And she goes up there sometimes and lays on the counter, but um, it gives you more space, more light. Mm -hmm. Mostly, she stays. She likes the cool um, floor. Oh right, pregnant mom. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, always are laughing. <laughs> I'll look away. Two humans in in one room. It's a lot. It's a lot for a nine nine day. Reformed, Daryl? <laughs> Newly reformed? Do you want the snack? Oh, your treats are over there. Can you see if we can get them out? Oops. Do you want the snack? Ooh. 
Oh, did you hear something? There. Good job. Look at she took keen hay on her. Mm-hmm. Or yeah. It's quick. She and she hasn't been she's like hissed a little bit and like she's giving me some very light swats, but nothing um nothing really aggressive. So really adaptable. She's done really well. Do you wanna go? You can go, you can go go closer to your friend Gwen. Or you can go hide in the corner. You want to follow him that way? And then we can stay in the snow. Mm -hmm. Wolf. <laughs> Tell her not to laugh. And... Gwen's gonna help do some meds and help get her used to one other person and oh she's so brave and very gentle. She looks really good. She does. Look, she's not. Um, I know. Ears are up yeah. and she's curious. I know. She's not petrified. That's yeah. Incredible. I know. Or I know. This is a big day and I did look at you for a second. <laughs> I will stop for no better. I know. It's been interesting because usually one of the things I look for is, you know, her eye, like how her eyes are reacting. And you can't really judge as much, you know, people's, people's eyes mm -hmm. and if she's blinking, if she's slow blinking, you know. So it's been kind of interesting, but I think, I think we lucked out that she's so good. She's so adaptable. Or else maybe there's something about being injured and... Sort of feeling like she doesn't have to constantly protect herself here. Mm -hmm. Maybe you're just feeling a bit safe. I don't know. Mm -hmm. So brave. My finger. This is actually lovely genetics to share with my baby. I know. If you feel that beautiful. This one's kibble. Yeah. See, I trick you. I like to trick her with nutritious food. It's like kale. Sneaking some kale into her smoothie. <laughs> oh, she's so good. Oh, she's so I feel like you drew I feel like I got some drool on you that time. Where are you going? Oh, she got nervous. See? Can you get it? So you would love her because she's very special. She's very special. And very praised. <laughs> in a nice way. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Sable has gotten very brave also, but in a defend the nest kind of way. Yeah, we won't hold that against her. She's no, a good mom. She's being a very good mom. But we had our first um, kitten pus the other day. The, the uh, eye pus. Oh. Bartholomew has a little bit of eye pus, so... I'm trying to give him an antibiotic ointment, but uh, Sable's questioning. She's not, yeah, she's not super impressed with my attempts. But, um, oh, sorry, I was just gonna put this a little bit. I didn't want it to fall on you. Are oh, you so cute? We haven't gotten any, any playing to happen just yet. Oh, well, look, now I can pet you. Now I can pet you like this. In your big wide bum. She has, she will, she followed, she was interested in this one a little bit and um, a little bit in this one, but there hasn't been any playing that I've seen. Are you going to turn around? <laughs> she says, stop touching you, you things. She's pretty good though. Oh, there's the palms coming up. Getting some elevator butt. Mm. 
really like that, huh? Oh, she's rubbing on the creek. You should come out and then I can meet you more. Just about anything. This is the only one I tried. I've tried so far, so I think she quite likes them. Too pretty cute. And anything else you've tried? Or Those are the only ones I've tried that in the kibble. So like tuna or anything like that? Oh, I did to. try tuna at the beginning. I did, um, she wasn't interested then, but it was just the first couple of days and then I switched over to the treats because I always smell like tuna. But you can try whatever you can try whatever you want to try. There may be also a carton of sardines, I think, somewhere. Okay. Which she might like. But Mother my dog. <laughs> just Hopefully yeah. She will. Smell really good. Then your dog will really like you yeah. guys. <laughs> <laughs> Never have a dog as my cat, I'd be afraid of. <laughs> Hello. She has not yet come out to me. But I feel like I feel like she's sort of close. There goes her tail. She's peeking around that side. <laughs> come on. I think it's awesome that she's she can she exits the lap and she doesn't run and hide yeah, and she's and I mean she doesn't seem to be like compacting mm -mm. herself into a corner or anything. Nope. She's nervous but she's not. Her neck is sort of it looks relaxed and not Yeah. Not looking like she's feeling super she needs to defend herself. That's not a teeth, that's a floor spot. <laughs> it is a teeth though. switch? Sure, I'm gonna try. Might be too much, but she's not in a super accessible spot, but I'm trying not to look at you. It's hard because we're adorable. I know, I know. She's so cute. Let me get her treats there. I know, I love her. She's a little treat on me. Yeah. Oh, she's so sweet. 
I can see her reflection. She's looking up. Yeah. I think she knows me a thing a little bit. Hey, I'm thinking about giving you a little bit. Oh, there she goes. Oh, you're so nice. Oh, you so nice. Oh, you're so nice. I like my freedom choices. Mm -hmm. I choose to be over here until mm -hmm. I fully evaluate your worthiness. Mm -hmm. That's pretty cute, though. That's really cute. Aww. What are you doing? What are you doing? You'd be so interesting to see me. Would be. Look at that hand, huh? She'll grab my finger sometimes, like when I'm giving her treat, she'll grab my hand. That's what this thing felt like. A, yeah. Um, a, a very cute. Two toes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, I started like trying to s trick her into doing some kibble too. Cookie? Do you have string on your head? <laughs> you do. Oh, could that be a cat toy? I guess she has to sort of alter her head mm -hmm. to get more, more of a better. Yeah. Yeah, you can tell that she when she tilts it. She says you can only have the back end. Oh, <laughs> so cute. Are you in control of the situation? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. might consider cookie. Oh, cute. She's so adorable. 
Oh, she likes it. She's got a rose. <laughs> so adorable. I don't have to look at you, but yeah. I can still get my butt scratched. I know, that's adorable. Tickle, tickle. She's gonna tickle my toes. I'm not sure how I feel about that. That was not a treat. <laughs> you better come up with a good stuff, lady. <laughs> in defensive, like, tiny mode. I don't want to put this back to Oh, you're so cute. She says you're spooky. Hi. Oh, she doesn't want to look at your face. Do temptations and kibble sound different when they hit the ground? <laughs> I think she's had, yeah, I think this is not her first either. That should help. Mm -hmm. I'm hoping, well, I, I'm not hoping for her sake, but I'm hoping for just to make things go easier. Look, man, she's squeezing me. That's very impressive. You could be fun. Just as long as you don't try to skip me on the kibbles. I know. <laughs> Just to take it in the lobby. Oh, she's got such soft lips. I know, she's so gentle. She, my, my cat would have taken my finger off at the, you know, yeah. probably the second knuckle. <laughs> but he's on a special diet, so. So is Pantaroo. Treats her far and few between. <laughs> <laughs> Unless they're stolen. <laughs> And he's very clever, so there's some thievery involved. Yes, Bunny is very moody. She'll come up here where, when you're not looking, and the, the paw will come up and onto the table and just grab whatever it can. Oh. And so sometimes you don't see it until she's got something. Yeah, Bear will take it right off your spoon. <laughs> so, um, and his arms are like Inspector Gadget arms. Oh. Like you think a cat's arms could only be so long. Yeah. But when there's food around, his are much longer and faster. Bunny, <laughs> make up your little soft key. Oh, happy, happy, <laughs> I'm giving you a temptation. I want you to love me. 
Okay. That's mm. still not responsible. Oh, there. See? Was that a kibble? That was a kibble. See, it was good. But I might not have I know. There's half a temptation. Yeah, may I get to feel your lip? Oh, <laughs> no. Oh. So nice not being the bath lady. I know. I not know. that I wouldn't be willing to do it again. No, I know. Most cute lady. Oh, that was crazy. Get to be a great guy. Yeah, it's funny. And tilt the temper on but that does not look too bad. Yeah, it's nice not just having the one. The serum I had to do like 20 to 30 minutes before the ointment. So. He was so gentle. I know, and then she said, Are you going to be such a good mommy? Look how relaxed you. I know. It would be so nice if she was also it's like this after the baby was home, but oh, that would be. <laughs> I'm not holding my breath. I'm not, ex I don't have, I'm not putting unrealistic expectations on her. No. <laughs> but then after her baby's a wee, yeah. she will be herself again. Yep, exactly. Right? And yourself is quite lovely. I know, your little paws. So cute. Your little paws. <laughs> She says, I want to be house guest. Mm -hmm. I think after the other moms are done, we'll, and when they're spayed, we'll bring them back and we'll see if, the, if we'll bring the smugglers back and then see if any of them have potential. But not till after. Not till after they're done. I don't know if they do. Yeah, she's looking like the best candidate, which mm -hmm. is lovely I because know. she needs to be the best candidate. I know. I was, yeah. If she was like Sweeney, then that would be tough. I don't think you could catch your own food. I don't think so. I know. And protect, I was just think, like thinking of her trying to protect her babies from predators and she can't see them come. Oh, it would be awful. And then could she... Could she risk getting food? I know. It'd be so much harder for her. I know. Oh, that's very nice. That's very nice. I felt like making her gut kiss. I don't think you chewed that one. <laughs> I think you swallowed it. Sometimes they just go right down. I, I didn't hear any chewing. That's much there. better. Thank you. <laughs> oh, she's cute. I know. Her little face. Oh. It's nice with not having a worried feral face. Yeah. So cute. You're so cute. Oh, be still my heart. She has a lovely little mouth, eh? I know, she's so cute. And even though her, her face is white, you can see her muzzle puffs. Like white lovely. Very cute little puffs. Hi. Could we be friends? Could we be friends? We can talk about it. She's like, try and get one more kibble on you, lady. <laughs> and the friendship is over. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> we'll, we'll give it a little, a little dessert now. She had her ears were pretty clean, so we didn't have the, I was a little worried that I wasn't going to have the ear. To massage. Uh -huh. Oh, because that's always been the feral, the feral the weakness. I know, the secret. Having their ears massaged and cleaned, but that was not... Not really a big deal for her. She's keeping her face in. I'm sure your viewers have figured out what kind of hat she's wearing. <laughs> I know, I think Mickey Mouse. Mickey Mouse. Ears. <laughs> <laughs> I think that was the consensus. Aww. And Sable's kittens are yams. They. Um, I saw the hand-drawn picture. Oh, yeah. I thought that was so good. I know. That was really cute. I would put that on a t-shirt. <laughs> that would be <laughs> yeah. yams. Only, only your viewers would get it, but... So cute. Oh, just make yourself comfortable now. I know. She's so mm -hmm. relaxed. She's not very mm -hmm. relaxed. You would never think she was a feral cat. If you met her at this point, you would think she was just, like, sh a little... Nervous. I just know a good thing when I see it. And safety. Big difference. Healthy food. And how many days has it been? Eight days, nine days maybe? That seems so Huge fast. Different. I know. So fast. I know. I wonder if like happy pregnancy hormones help. Maybe. 
Yeah. Are you a happy pregnant cat? Mm. She's like, you gotta be kidding. You didn't hand that one to me? Yeah. <laughs> right. <laughs> you cannot talk me into coming out. Because I'm getting everything I want right here. <laughs> she used your paw. You want to get up? I'm pregnant. I just need my arm. You have any Inspector Gadget arm? <laughs> mm -hmm. personalities. I know. They've all been so different. It's so it makes it so hard to predict success or you know, if if you can socialize or not socialize. Oh, like Inara. Yeah. She was like so just interesting. I never would have would have guessed, right? Uh -huh. Yeah. No. I know. I don't think she was ever owned by anyone who uh, was caring for her because she's had this eye condition is chronic and she's had it since she was a kitten just like all like Bartholomew if, if his eye wasn't treated could develop into something like this although his is very mild right now but um, she she was probably born with this and has had it her whole life so I don't think that she would be, she wouldn't have been anyone's loved pet because um, we wouldn't be seeing this degree of disease, chronic disease, at a year old or a year and a half old. She may have been, you know, hanging around a barn or something like that, but nobody cared enough to get her vet, vet attention, so I don't think. Little pea pie. You are so cute. You are so cute. Yeah. Oh, I love to pee. I love to pee. <laughs> For the quick peek. You know, because sometimes she probably can't focus in that fast on your eyes anyway. So. Yeah. <laughs> she says, as long as that you are respectful, I am a cat, you know. <laughs> She's very cute. She is. You would look lovely on someone's pillow. Mm-hmm. You would. You would look lovely on someone's pillow. You strike me as a pillow cat. <laughs> See if she'll g if you if you give her chin scratches if she'll give you access. She says, um, your finger smells good, but it's not a treat. She's so disappointed. Yeah. You scratch my chin, but I'm not done smacking. Yeah. No. No. Here's the food. <laughs> you and I don't have that kind of relationship, she says. We were just good for food so far. We're just good for food. Oh, well. Maybe. <laughs> uh, I'm going to keep her cat for just a minute. Mm -hmm. She does really like food. Oh, there we go. Now we got the one. Oh, and it's coming. <laughs> Where are you? Oh, could it be that there's treats falling over here? Or it could be kibble. I know. Mm. Oh, is she having a post meal wash? She might be done. <laughs> <laughs> yes, she's so. <laughs> you two in back there. What are you doing back there? What are you doing with your babies? No, she's in doing that. Hey, darling. 
She can camouflage them with her black spots. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, sweetheart. She's doing. It's amazing when she when she for the first time, couple of days when I would visit her, respiration was so fast. She was almost kind of hyperventilating. Oh. She doesn't do that anymore. Although I think some of that sometimes is a pregnancy thing, but hers were pretty timed with my visits. She's definitely relaxed quite a bit. Very nice. Oh, a big sigh. Oh, she's going to get over. Very cute. And this is nap time. Oh, we can unravel. Oh, we just have a butt shot over here. <laughs> Here's her bump, her baby bump. Pretty big. It does look big from that angle, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. And she's just chilling it on the tile. Yeah, but this is tile is very uh, cool. It's nice. Is that nice? I think I can control my temperature. And due dates pretty close. I think, well, we saw it around 50 days on the 25th. Oh, oh. So, 
maybe about another week or so. Week. Yeah, hard to say. Because she hasn't been super active with the babies, but that usually you can see them about two weeks in advance. I have seen them. They just haven't been super obvious. Or like constant. Mia's have been pretty active. Oh really? Mm-hmm. She's she started uh her fourteen days will be up on the sixth, so I think she's gonna go first. <laughs> she's but like a bit dirty from the rear. I know, totally <laughs> different. And then she's like stripy on this side. Yeah, looks like two different cats. Uh huh. Yep. Do you see any movement? I have felt some. I've gotten head butted. Oh, look who's in her nest. Oh, I'm gonna sneak out and try to get the patio closed. You can stay if you want or you can look at where you want. I'll stay for another couple minutes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's see like whether she's gonna make a run for it. Oh, I can eat that in here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. or, I'm, I'm good. You can you can see out. I don't know if you can see out there what's on the Oh I better not. She might make a run for it and then then I have some splaining to do. <laughs> <laughs> she's been pretty good about that. I'll just stay for another minute. How are you doing, Teeny Peanut? How are you doing? Hi, pretty girl. Shelby will adjust her camera. I think so. I think so. Yeah. Because we don't want people not to be able to see when you go back in your nest. What do you think? I'm not sure of the answer. We'll find out though. We'll find out. Hmm? Can you watch me put your little cat food back? Yeah. 
I just put it like kind of aimed at the, yeah, and you can kind of see what it's looking like on that. And then I was putting this on the oh, okay. toilet paper, the toilet paper tripod. And then, yeah, sort of like that. I'm just going to sit over this one. Oh, okay, so it's indirect light. Yeah, because okay. I don't want to like, and this has multiple brightnesses, so it's on the lowest one, so it's not super bright in there. And then. Yeah, that's pretty much it. And then the other camera. They can just uh, sometimes I have to find them where she's hanging out and kind of Okay. Well hi, hey, you look very scared for your sister with your hair right here. Well not treat, but when I'm standing up she's like I'm happy you met me back. Yes, you want it too. You can relax now, my friend. You can be really best friend. Be very cute right together. So brave. So this one can probably just stay. Oh, oh, sorry, that made a noise, huh?